Hi all. Hey, uh, you all have uh, has requested uh, to learn a bit more about how to get stars and get the green points, uh, also known as GP. Uh, well, stars and GP is basically what you buy stuff with in this game. So in order to improve your skills, to get some better stats by buying clothes, upgrading your equipment. You will need uh, you'll need uh, GP and you'll need stars uh, for some of this, uh, especially the upgrading if you want to use the advanced upgrading. And from the very beginning, there are a lot of places where you actually can get this. I'll try to cover as many as I can think of here in this video. So first of all, let's go and look into the game modes. Up here we obviously have a, a career mode. In here you uh, you will start as beginner. And if you go in and look, you can see you get different prizes for completing different tasks. Some places you'll get some GP. And I would guess at the end, you would also get some stars. This is obviously not very much five stars when you know what things actually cost. But as you advance, you'll be able to get even more. Uh, if you look at the professional mode. So for completing this, you get 10. You get 10 for the one before. And you get a small... Uh, a lot of small prices like uh, 5 and 10 and they all add up then if you have the special membership uh, or the VIP membership you each week can participate in uh, special events which is both for the junior the amateur the semi-professional and the professional and in each of these you'll get a prize uh, uh, of five to ten stars plus some green points for more or less just participating yeah i guess you have to come one on the par and around here but that should definitely be be doable then you have the world korea uh, which was introduced in 2015. this is every week where you get a chance to complete uh, some courses you would normally for the first round in each get some gp and for completing the last ones, you get 20, 20, 20, and 20. So you can actually earn 80 stars there every week. Um, for other game modes, uh, the one-on-one -on -one matches, uh, there are now two different kinds. We have the one-on-one -on -one match, the regular one. And for this one, you'll be able to, uh, once you win more, have a winning streak of, I think, seven or more matches, then you'll get some stars, actually, up until, I think, when you have a streak of 20 matches won, then that's about it, what you get. Uh, it will take some time and some effort to get those stars. The new mode here, uh, which is uh, quite nice, is like a tournament where you start in a round of uh, 32 and can advance all the way to the semifinal here. You can actually see the prizes. So if you go all the way here, uh, you can earn 360 stars by doing that. I have only reached the semifinal so far, but I also only played it once so far. Um, then you have the tour. Once you read, uh, reach, I believe it's amateur and above, you have this uh, weekly tour where you have some prizes for the free first places. Uh, this, is, uh, this is really some good stars. I think it starts around 50 stars you can uh, for winning at the amateur, but now this Master Pro uh, B level, you win 600 uh, stars for winning. Of course, the competition is a lot tougher here. If we look at what the scores are, it yeah, actually doesn't look too bad right now, but I'm guessing that someone will beat these scores. Um, 
But it's definitely doable and it's it's worth it. And if, if you can make it, then just don't play for a week and you drop down a rank and then you can play the next week and uh, hopefully do better. Then we have the... Uh, World Championship. So you want to see them? I actually just got twenty thousand GP, and that was for uh, playing just one tournament, I believe. So if you have the time to to play just one of the tournaments, then do this because then you will probably get around twenty thousand uh, GPs just for that one tournament. And if you can participate in more, you can get. A hundred thousands, and you can also get stars if you're really, really, really good. But you need to be in the top. You can get up to two thousand stars. But this is this is really tough competition in here. You more or less need to win all the tournaments you participate in, and you need to participate in quite a lot of them. Uh, I haven't won any stars in this yet. Uh, I hope I will at some point, but I'm just not good enough yet. Um, then log in every day, every day for a three hour period. They uh, they offer uh, some prizes for you. This can be GP, this can be stars, putting guides, etc. It's, it's worth taking along. Check this one out also, the this one here, because every day you get this free star. Click this and you get one free. That's 365 stars every year. Always look at the events that are there running. They have some check-in events. Uh, um, so right now there's this March check-in event, uh, which is actually not too detailed here. Uh, normally it comes with a nice graphic of what you get. But I guess I have a lot of mails here from previous events, and I would guess some of them contains stars or GPs, or at least a lot of items. There was 5,000 GPs. Oh, well, I actually no stars. Yeah, I had hope for that. The stars are the ones that are really difficult to get and that you really want. Take on a sponsor. Try to clear some missions. You can get some stars and some GPs. Um, your event missions. Um, each day you'll be able to take a new event mission. Uh, there's an easy one, and there's a uh, hard one, and you can get both stars and GP there. Then the guild, if you join a guild, let's see, you get, even for losing a guild battle, you get some GP, you can collect these missions here, and you'll get 30,000 GP here. Uh, so that also adds up. Um, if you can get the VIP membership, you also earn more GP and your costumes are actually cheaper. And uh, this is also recommended once you save up for that. Completing milestones. Uh, when you start out, you have a lot of milestones. So you can get a lot of stars by complete, completing these. Um, And I think that's about it, how to make these stars. Of course, you can buy them, uh, but your wallet will soon be empty if you if you have to buy all your stars, because they are actually pretty expensive. Um, but it's definitely doable to get a, a long way in this game without having to buy any stars or GP. Um, but you have to log in every day, maybe play one game, and they should come in for you. I think that was about it. Uh, there were some other requests about potting, etc. This is something that will come on later. And yes, I'll be back with that. See you guys.